strange things have happened in this game before. And look, we, we're obviously a long way behind the game at the moment. Uh, I think we need another 280 runs. But strange things have happened in this game before. And we're not discounting ourselves just yet. I thought Imran Tahir bowled really well today. Mornay Morkel has been outstanding for us with the ball. So those are the two standout performers for us today. Look, I, th I think the captain felt that Simon was bowling really well, particularly to the left-hander. Looked like he could get the left-hander out at any stage. The ball was beating the bat. Um, then he brought JP on because with the ball spinning away from JP, he thought that JP could maybe do some damage. Um, and that's, those are probably the main reasons he bowled him. Um, Look, Imran's bowled really well this game and, and, and he's bowled really well this whole series. But we do know that he's got the tendency to at times leak runs, um, particularly when there are two batters set. Uh, and the captain probably felt that at that stage he'd probably go the, the more, um, he'd go the bowler that he felt he'd have more control with at that particular stage. And that, that's the reason that he didn't bowl him at that stage. I think if you're winning the series, it's easy to criticise the pitch. I think if you're behind in the series, it's difficult to criticise the pitch. Um, if that makes some sense. Um, so you've got to give India credit. They've, they've prepared wickets that suit their style of play and the spinners have been really good. They've, been, they've, they've bowled outstandingly well um, and they've got to take some credit for that. So we're not going to criticise the pitch right now. Consistency. I think, I, th I think the Indian spinners have landed the ball more consistently than our spinners have landed the ball and have asked questions for longer periods of time. We've landed the ball in good areas for two or three overs. They've landed in good areas for eight or nine overs, and that's been the difference. Um, we've beaten the bat twice, and then we've given a soft single away. They haven't done that, and that's been the difference regarding the, two, the, the, the spinning options at the moment. Like I said, you, you always feel you can do better. You always feel that there's room for improvement, and, and, and we know that we probably haven't batted to our ability, but it's damn tough batting out there. Uh, it's shown, I think, they've been... One Indian player has scored over 50 in the series, and that's Murli Vijay. AB scored two 50s thus far, and that's it. Um, so although we haven't batted well, India have got 100 runs more than us in the second innings, and that might, I mean, it, it's 100 runs, a lot of runs, but it's not a lot of runs, if that makes sense. Um, so we haven't batted well, we know that, but batting conditions are really, really difficult, particularly with the quality of the Indian bowlers on that particular surface. How much does it mean? 280 is 280. No matter where you're playing, it's 280, that's what we've got to try and get, and that's what we're going to give a go at tomorrow. It was part of it, I think, um, and it has shown that if you just sit there and look to absorb and stay and look to score, you're going to get a ball that's going to get you out. Um, so the plan was to not play loosely, but look to score, look to be positive in our defence, look to be positive in when we're attacking. Um, and it didn't work this morning, unfortunately. Um, but you've got to look to score. All the guys that have got runs are the guys that have looked to score. And we're going to look to score again tomorrow. That's, we're not going to block out three days, that's for sure.